Welcome to HTML5 Tutorial 1, Intro and Setup. In this series, I'll be covering HTML and the basic building blocks of a static website. This series is aimed at people who have never used HTML before, and I'll be assuming that you have no prior knowledge of the language. Every video will have all slideshows and code available in the description. This series of tutorials will try to cover as much of HTML as possible. The kinds of things we'll be looking at are what are tags and the basics of a page, attributes and links, formatting and images, the head and styling, tables and lists, forms and iframes, and media. Though not all of HTML5's features will be fully explored, this will form the basis for the other primary web languages like CSS, JavaScript, and PHP. So what is HTML? HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. It is the base language for the web. Our web browsers, like Chrome or Firefox, turn HTML code into the pretty websites we browse each day. HTML uses a tag system to tell our browser what the page should look like. Though websites these days are more than just HTML, you still need to understand HTML before you can move on to other languages. As you'll see, it starts off very basic. Let's get on to getting ourselves set up to start programming in HTML. The great thing about HTML is that it runs in a browser just like the one you're using right now. We can also write the code in any text editor. You could use Notepad, WordPad, Vim, Notepad++, anything that allows you to write text. Some are better than others though. I suggest getting Notepad++. It's free and will highlight the code for you to make it easier to read. To download Notepad++, we need to go to the website notepadplus.org. A link will be in the description. Once Notepad++ is installed, you can right click on any text file and click edit in Notepad++. First, we'll be looking at what tags are and the basics of a web page. If you have any questions, leave it in the comments and I'll try to answer it as best as possible. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.